Man, have we got some catching up to do. Welcome back to an idiot's road to glory where we've got some catching up to do with this road to glory. We've got some catching up to do with FIFA because we've got three messages here. One of them is that if you press the Xbox button or the PS button while you're in actually in the game, playing the game on Foot Champs this week, you will instantly be given a loss, which is good. So you guys know if you press it for more than five seconds, you already get one. Now, if you press it during gameplay, instant loss bit mental that is like their hot fix patch a band-aidy type fix instead of actually fixing the glitch to stop people doing the no loss glitch we've also got some maintenance and due to unforeseen issues foot champions prizes have been delayed so no foot champs rewards video today because of that no loss glitch now as you guys can see i have only got twenty thousand coins because there is a lot of different things that we need to catch up on now some of them twenty thousand coins are actually an insane player that I packed on stream. Now, you might be thinking, stream? What stream? And it, I'll, we, we'll come on to that in a second and how this is going to go down from now on with this Road to Glory and why also I've been kind of away since the last video from literally spending all day on the toilets to just being busy with other stuff and being sick and stuff like that. So we'll get to that. But let's just jump in with some of the good stuff. So I streamed last Friday. It went very, very well. We got a Foot Champs record of... 4-1, and one, which was pretty sick. We went 4-0, and oh, and then I lost the last game to someone who was probably, like, the worst player I've played out of all of the five. I ended up losing. A little bit tired from streaming. We've been on, like, two and a half hours. I need to play games in a little bit more quick succession. But, anyway, in between that, we're actually going to, we were doing some of these daily squad builder challenges for the one-to-watch players, and I think there's actually still one there. Yeah, there is. There's the Lucas Moira one, which we can actually go and do now and get some more packs. We'll do that in a second. However, if we take a look at this pack, you will see as the pack opens, when we opened one of the packs we got for doing the very first one, I think it was the Coutinho one, we packed ourselves a Verratti, who is of course a walkout. So an 87 rated in a SBC pack that we basically traded in absolutely nothing for. We got two of them in the second one. I think we got a Fernandez. Let me get it up on my PC here. It was. It was Nacho Fernandez, 81 rated. But across the two of them, using literally just untradeable players in my club, it's actually pretty decent. You'll also have seen by the title of this stream that we've signed someone absolutely huge. So you'll get onto that as well. First of all, let's do this SBC. Plays from the same league four, leagues min four, nationalities min three. That's pretty easy. That's really easy, actually. Okay, let's get my untradeable golds up at centre mid. What can we do here? He's not untradeable, but we'll put Alan in anyway. In fact, I feel like I'm going to show you guys who the main player is that we've signed while we're doing this. So instead, I'm going to show you it right, right now. So... This Road to Glory has been a little bit differently because we've got a lot of footage that I've recorded while I've been playing and doing stuff and not actually been filming a video. So let me just let me just show you the footage. The player that I went and signed was none other than David De Gea for 195,000 coins. And here he is chilling in my squad, looking very, very, very good. I played a few foot champs games with him. He is absolutely incredible. I played four. He's so much better than Farmer. It's ridiculous. He's actually unreal. So I spent 200k on him, the 200,000 coins that I had, and it was a very, very, very good decision. The team is looking filthy. Gareth Bale is an absolute beast. All of them games are in foot champs. He scores over a goal a game. The Cambu's pretty decent. Pretty decent. I'm tempted to get Griezmann instead of him for this week's foot champs. And Coutinho, he's pretty good. He gets the job done, I suppose. He's the best camp from a left mid player, if that makes sense. Best, the best left mid you can play at camp. Anyway, what I want to do with this team is get Griezmann to go to start at striker and play camp and Cristiano Ronaldo to go left forward and play striker in game. And that would basically be the most meta dream team I possibly can. But to do that, I need to make about another 1.7 million coins. So it's going to be a while until we can afford... Ronaldo unless I get properly grinded and get properly lucky in my rewards. Unfortunately, continuing the catch-up, I didn't actually finish foot champs last week. We got silver three, which is very annoying. I did end up going a little bit mad and I, I was playing it like, yeah, we played 14 games, we won nine, lost five. 
I was at a 1.7 and 1, maybe 8 and 1. No, it's, it was 7 and 1. It was 7 and 1 when I was actually playing properly seriously. The problem was I got really sick and was, sparing you the gruesome details, was basically just on the toilet. So, <laughs> we missed out on playing a lot of foot champs. I probably, I played quite a few on stream on Friday and then I should have played a lot more on Saturday and I don't think I actually played any because it got announced that it had been extended. So I was like, you know what? I'm just gonna have a break on Saturday. We play loads on Sunday and loads on Monday. Absolutely fine. And then I ended up not being able to do anything on Sunday, basically. So I didn't get any done then, which then meant I had to do all of Monday's work. On, it basically just ended up not having any time to play foot champs on Monday because of that. Because I couldn't do anything on the weekend. And then, yeah, I think I came back from footy on Monday night at like half ten. Had something to eat and started playing some foot champs. Till like, once I'd had a shower night until like 3am. Didn't get particularly many wins. What I was trying to do was get to silver two, but at this point, and I was just losing stupid games because I was absolutely knackered. Like games I should have easily been winning. Out of them 14 games, I should easily have got 11 wins, but I just couldn't. I, it was just killing me. It was like three o'clock in the morning. I was like, screw this, I'm going to bed. I'll just play. I'd rather play four games in the knockout tournaments than two games right now to get qualifications. So that is exactly what we're going to do today. So welcome back to the road to glory. <laughs> I'm going to get in to what is going to be going down in the road to glory as well. Well, while we're doing it, while I'm talking to you guys, we may as well actually play a game because I feel like I've just rammed a ton of information down your throat and you might have even been able to keep up with it all. So basically, we packed Verratti, pretty good, sold him and used the coins. I think we also sold Pepe as well after packing him and getting hold of him last week to be able to afford David De Gea, who we spent almost 200,000 coins on, but he is an absolute beast. So that's basically where we're at. We got silver awards. Unfortunately, there are not they're not coming out yet basically they've been delayed because of people cheating so we're just going to get in and try and qualify for some foot champs and do it properly this week and stream it as well so that's the thing i know it's been like i'm pretty sure that's the same guy i know it's because i'm sending oakley files hey there we go there's a oh, okay there's another whatever it's the first round if we if it's terrible we can just play it again. If it's if we win, we win. Whatever. Crappy connection. Let's just go for it. What teams he got? All right, he's got a basic Premier League team. Decent. We should be able to beat this guy. Okay. So what happened was it has been about a week. Has it been? A, yeah, it's been exactly a week since I actually uploaded the video, which is awful on my part. We did stream some foot champs though. So if you tuned into the stream, thank you very much. If you are wondering what on earth I am on about, we will be streaming again tomorrow. So instead of a video on the weekends now, what I'm going to do is an Idiot Road to Glory live stream. So you guys can come check it out, tune in, get involved with decisions, watch me play some foot champs mostly. And it'll basically just, instead of me playing foot champs and just getting, oh, don't get forward, stay back just getting totally distracted by foot champs and it just draining the life out of me and we're then not getting any videos because I end up playing 40 games of foot champs and then chopping down 40 games of foot champs and talking back over 40 games of foot champs. It's just so dead. I just don't want to make videos on that. And then when I'm doing foot champs, for them three days, I don't want to be... Well, it's not that I don't want to be, it's just I don't have the will to then go and make a video on three other different things for Friday, Saturday and Sunday to upload. So instead, we're going to stream Foot Champs, and that is going to be the Idiot's Road to Glory content during the weekend. So I'm not going to go be as bold as to say 7 o'clock on Friday we are going to stream. But if you just turn notifications on for the channel, if you're subscribed, click the little bell next to it. You will get a notification to your phone when the live stream starts. And you can just come and hang out and watch me play some Foot Champs and whatnot. And hopefully we'll do very well because we were actually doing sick. Like this new patch really suits me. I think I play very, very well with it. I was playing the best FIFA I've ever played. We've just megged his goalie. That's great. Gareth Bale's a beast. <laughs> Best FIFA I've ever played. I pl won four games in a row on the stream at the start, and then we lost the last one, which is silly. One of the games that we did win was one of them games where it was a 50-50 toss-up, where one of us was going to win or the other one was going to win, and we were both equally as good at FIFA and had equally good teams, and it was just luck that I won it, basically. I think I scored a really, really like proper FIFA goal from a corner, where it deflected around and his goalie fell over and then I tapped it in an open goal in the 90th minute. So it felt kind of bad, but that's just one of them things in it. It evens out over foot champs and it did end up evening out because in my other ones, in my other games, 
in another game, sorry, it was another 50-50 job. I think I ended up losing on pens. So, it evened out. It was fair. So, from my first 10 games, I feel like the way I played, and I know I should, you can't say, oh, I should have won that game. Should have, there we go. It doesn't quite work like that, but at the same time, like, you guys know what it's like playing FIFA. Some games, you just absolutely batter someone, and no matter what you do, what you do, you just can't win. You just There was nine of them. Well, no, there wasn't nine of them games. There was nine games where I feel like I should have won. Sorry, eight games where I feel like I should have won. Two 50-50s. So if you take the two 50-50s and give me a loss from one and a win from the other, that put me at nine and one. And I think from my first 10, I was seven and three because there was two games where one of them I was playing stupid and one of them where I just couldn't win. The last game of the stream was just... Maybe I was a bit tired and there was a couple of things I could have done that would have made me win anyway. But it was just fully FIFA being like, you're not going to win this game, Andy. So, couldn't do nothing about that. And then I think the first game I came back after that, I lost because I was just being stupid, to be honest. If I wasn't concentrating at all. So, it's my own fault. I should have won the games. I didn't. But going back, I think if I was playing all of them on stream, 100% would have won nine. Maybe, maybe eight. Probably nine. So, I'll take it. We're playing really good FIFA, basically, is what I'm getting at. And I feel like we can actually do well in these weekend leagues. And I feel like I can still get Elite monthly, even though I've only got nine wins. I do. It does involve getting Elite twice this month, so it's going to be a big task. But we're going to go for it, and we're going to try and do it. And I'm semi-confident that I feel like I am a lot better at FIFA than I've ever been. So, with missing out on Elite by one or two wins most week anyway... I feel like I can squeeze out a couple of wins because the amount of games I used to lose just because of kickoff goals was an absolute joke, to be honest with you. And they've gone, so I'm doing fine. It's literally, if people can actually break me down like a normal person, then fair enough, you deserve to win. But none of this stupid me passing the ball around, having 70% possession, finally breaking them down, and then they just sprint down the pitch from kickoff and score past me. So we're feeling good, and we will be streaming it this weekend on... Providing everything goes to plan. Friday night, Saturday night, and Sunday night. Night slash evening, UK time. So I'm talking maybe like finish watching the footy on Saturday. Maybe grab some dinner or maybe just go for it and then finish for dinner. So we're talking like 7 o'clock, 8 o'clock. Maybe 6 o'clock on Friday. Once you guys are back from school and work and stuff like that. So it's going to be good. We're going to get some streams on the go. I will obviously not just... I won't just play every single bit of foot champs on stream because that would kill me because streaming it makes it even more tiring talking all the time like playing this game my voice is going because i'm talking and waffling so much because i've got so much to tell you guys maybe this guy's gonna rage quit now and that'll be a nice easy win in the first round but what was i saying streaming foot champs makes foot champs harder so we won't stream all 40 games but we might stream like five on five or ten on friday night five or ten on Saturday night, 5 or 10 on Sunday night, something like that. Maybe like 5 to 7 is probably realistic. And then I'll do the rest Friday morning, Saturday morning, Sunday morning off camera. And it should be good. It should be fun. Hopefully it's going to bring the life back into me wanting to properly grind out this road to glory and get myself a Cristiano Ronaldo because even though I'm not the most consistent with this anymore, when it, when it first started it was a novelty and I was absolutely loving it. Whereas recently YouTube's been kind of doing my editing and if I'm going to grind out and concentrate on something i've got to concentrate on my main channel because that's actually my job whereas this one's sort of a little side projecty bit of fun kind of thing so hope you guys understand that but we are gonna get back on it hopefully i know i keep saying that and something keeps coming up and this time it genuinely wasn't my fault i was just on the toilet all weekend so <laughs> there was nothing i could do about that to be honest i had a pad tie on friday evening i think and it it turned into a bad tie it was not good Okay, <laughs> me and Katie made it together, but she just didn't fancy it at all once we'd served it and she didn't eat any of it. So she was absolutely fine. So that's the only thing that I can think it was because I ended up eating like a portion and a half because I was starving. Wasn't good. Was not good. But this video is turning very much into waffly stream kind of video. So if you want me talking rubbish or to be honest, in the stream, I don't talk this much because it's serious games of FIFA. And as you probably watch from this gameplay, it's been absolutely terrible. I'm playing like an idiot, but luckily this guy is tragic at FIFA. We are getting away with it. It's more really concentrate and play serious. And I will talk through what I'm doing if you guys aren't 
I know I'm not the best at FIFA in the world, but I'm I'm decent. And if you guys want to be like, oh, I want to be able to get gold, I want to be able to qualify for foot champs, I want to try and push onto the elite and stuff. There'll be tips and stuff like that. And if you've got a better mentality than me, you can pick them up and use them and just come and ask me some questions, chill, comment. I reply to the comments when the ball goes out to play because I ain't looking at the chat when we're in a game because I'm not even looking at the chat. I'm just chatting and I'm playing silly. So what we're going to do is I will finish off this game for this video, basically, because I've been talking for a little bit, catching you guys up with what has been going on. I'll finish this game off. I'll then off camera qualify for the rest of this weekend league or do the rest of this tournament to qualify for this weekend league to make sure we actually get through and because there isn't going to be a video tomorrow because there's going to be a stream so we don't even need to record it because if you're going up on Monday I'll be like guys I qualified for the weekend league you'll be like yeah I know Andy I watched you play it live so yeah the rest of this video will be me playing the well, finishing off this game if this guy doesn't rage quit but that is just a very big update, a very big sign in as well. That's our highest rated player ever in the team. 90 rated David De Gea, 200,000, not the most expensive. That was Hernandez at 500k, but the highest rated, 90 rated David De Gea. Very, very, very nice. There's half time. That is 4-1. Let's go to the highlights of this game and I'll see you guys at the end of it. Hopefully, I mean, we basically have won the first round. <laughs> Gareth Bale is just too good. He's actually insane. This is the first time I've used him. Oh, okay, this guy's going to rage quit, I think. It's the first time. Yeah, there we go. Okay, that's the end of this video then. That was nice and easy. It's the first time I've used him not in foot champs. So against in foot champs, he does bits and he usually scores a goal or two a game. But, well, we've seen his record. He scores just over one goal a game. Some games he won't score and other games he'll get two, obviously. But that's the first time I've used him against someone who probably isn't going to get into foot champs if he plays like that in that tournament, which just sounds harsh, but okay, whatever. <laughs> he scored four goals in 50 minutes. He's actually a joke. So I need to play these remaining three games, but that is where we will leave it for now. I hope you guys have enjoyed this video. I apologize that it hasn't been, there hasn't been a video for a while. Like I said, I was sick this weekend. I was doing work and catching up and then playing some foot champs Monday. It was Reeves brother's birthday on Tuesday, and then yesterday I was just like, it's just a bit of a dead video. I suppose I could have caught you up, but we didn't. We were going to come at you with some rewards today and just get everything back before this weekend stream and then the delayed rewards. So we'll open the rewards at the start of the stream tomorrow. For now, though, thank you very much for watching. I hope you guys are enjoying the fact that this series is back and actually going to have some regular content. Three streams this weekend, hopefully. Thank you very much for watching, and I'll see you guys soon. Remember to click that bell as well so you know when the streams are.